sometimes some people will say I am young and you are wrong an example in 2014 I was speaking this same message in a church over there the brand church answer called the place the brand church yeah I was preaching and I said some of you are teenagers now but you have already missed the plan of God for your life and you do not know there's a particular girl there who used to sing for us and, and if she worships throughout the week I can't pray when I want to pray like this I remember a worship line the, thing, the pillows and the glory too will take over my soul that's the only thing I'll be singing ah, throughout she began to do long nails head of human beings on nails I will sit down where I am I am a preacher of God's kingdom and righteousness there are things that should not be known of some people at all there's a time of preparation where you don't need long nails to do what now a time is coming you're going to do whatever you like to do in moderation because you'll have understood it but a 17 year old with long nail the nail now has eggs and she will be playing our keyboard I will stand in the congregation and just say, Jesus, Jesus. God will ask me, is this, if I have allowed that to continue in this church, the church will have been worldly before you came. Not only did was she doing that, she was now bringing boyfriend. He said, this is the person I want to marry. And then she will put head on the shoulder of that person in the church. I, my stomach was turning me. So one day, as he was the head of the choir, one day, Robasta was one of the assistants of the choir that time. See, Robasta was in the choir singing. You'll be so surprised. <laughs> There's no difference. He's singing like it's only that the dancing. If they drum to this side, Robasta could go like, <laughs> like no matter. <laughs> they say, gang, 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 gang. When you are supposed to do like this, Robasta can do like this. <laughs> now he's dancing better now. If you see him now, if Robert, like on Sunday, he was doing like this, I was showing people. I said, I said, the, I said the whole happiness, the excitement is so much when you see his body just. It just, just make it just. <laughs> but that time, they, when they sing to this side, they, <laughs> when they sing in English, Robasta is singing in Irish. <laughs> but he was singing. He was a very faithful assistant to, to many choir leaders, at least two. And I said, I call him in the middle of the night. I couldn't sleep. I just text her, if you will continue with your nail, can you please move into the congregation? until you decide whether you want to nail I'm telling you what I said and it's live now please record it, it's live don't, don't die hiding things in your body like some of you who went to a meeting yesterday where they were mocking you at the student representative meeting after the SU president himself was the one who called you record this thing I am a human being from Africa I was never a slave anywhere and I talk since I was born I've been talking And then you go there, you say, you Christian, you don't have voice, you need voice. Uh, so. And the next meeting, don't go. You have said what you want to say. Let them do what they want to do. And then do what you want to do. You are a student. You are free to live your life. Preach Christ and Him crucified. Preach Him. And he, so I told him, I told her. The mother brought her to my eyes. Yes, you, you offended my daughter. I said, how? Oh. From there, the, there will always be a church that will take you the way you are, no matter what you're doing. But they may destroy your life further. In no time, I've heard that she's even using her body to beg people around Limbrick. And I called and I told her that time, I said, there's a hand of God over your life. I said, it's heavy. I said, I'm not joking. My deep cause to your deep, there's a hand of God, if you can protect it. Right now, I don't even know where the person is in the faith. The last person I asked the person come and come and come and play for us was around 2015. The person could not connect between keyboard and the flow of the Holy Spirit. That was an holiness. You could be looking at me right now, young, but it, you have missed it. You don't have to be 75 before you miss it. People would discover that they have missed it at 75. They already missed it from 15. It depends on when God started with you. Some people start raining 12. Some people started raining 16 and whatever. It's different from somebody who start who got to know God from 50. I 
as a matter of fact when we are saying God use me and as we are praying that prayer some people need to pray the prayer of God have mercy upon me restore me I was talking with Pastor Sade the other day and said, he said, ah, he said, I, and I said, when people are saying, God, you disappointed me. He said, I said, I said, I don't pray that kind of prayer. I said, no. I started very early in my life and at the time I blew it. I said, so the life I'm living now is a borrowed life. So I know what prayer I pray. Father, thank you for giving me life. Father, thank you for giving me the chance to live a borrowed life. Please, what can you use? What can you do with this life? I'm not part of the people who say, God, do you remember 32 years ago? What? <laughs> what did he hold me that he didn't give me? <laughs> There's nothing he holds me. And some of you that are, us, that are already tendencies, that things are getting messed up. And you know salary is the bribe you are giving to forget your destiny. Sometimes you could be getting a salary and you don't know you don't have a destiny. And salary is plenty else in this country. It's the gift you are given to forget your destiny. There's a destiny that is different from salary. And that destiny is your trajectory with God. What God wants to do with you. There's a fingerprint of God over your life. There's an original fingerprint of God over your life of what he wants to use you for. I was telling Pastor Sade and he said, the reason why God armed is so heavy on me, he said, from young age, God has told me he wanted to use me. But I will tell God what I want to do, I cannot do. What I do not want to do, I do. <laughs> he said right now, the way God is flogging me. I said, no, he's using you, he's not flogging. He said, Pastor, he's not flogging. He's not flogging you. He's not flogging you. The things that God will have done with you gently at young age, you will now be using tears and white hair to do with pain in the future there's no reason you have your chance and i'm telling you now as god's mouthpiece there's a season upon us because only in the day of his power his people are willing we're doing bible study here this is europe all of you are well cute dressed up your heart is ready to receive from the lord sometimes i look at this place i say it's not the most comfortable of all churches Everybody is in their jacket, but then nobody is discouraged. Everybody is still coming and with happiness, with joy. Friday, my young daughter was telling me, he said, he said, Friday prayer is something else for me. My young daughter here, he said, moves my spirit. Friday prayer. And we are fasting. And everybody comes, comes here, and everybody is praying. The most surprising one is the early morning one and the, the, the midnight one. Where nobody is leading nothing. Even me. Once I take this thing in my hand. I come here very weak. I say Holy Spirit tell me. I know there are things to pray about. But my mother is telling me that everything has been prayed about. And I know it's a lie. So Holy Spirit. Help me here. I don't call myself servant of God in the presence of God. Maybe to you I'm a servant of God. I'm just a child. Who doesn't even know what he's doing. Say, help me. All of a sudden, the session of the Holy Spirit that comes on me. He can come with a body for a particular thing. I've forgotten that everybody's in this place. I am totally detached from you. Satopra, Lebranosh, Zezepra, Dahala, help me. Eyes, Elots, Pranis, Pranos, Densa, Tombra, Denkra. And no matter how much I pray, I don't feel satisfied that I've prayed. That's a season. That's a season. Are you listening? And this season you will not miss out. I can't hear you, Amen. I say you will not miss out. I say at this season you will not miss out. You will not let people calling you a weirdo make you miss out. There is something God is doing from here. I cannot tell of any other church or any other place. But there is something God is doing from here. God is raising champions. God is raising eagles. God is raising people who will take over certain territories. And we need to take over them spiritually first. And they become manifest physically. Some of you will find yourself becoming CEO of banking sectors. I, I'm, I'm telling you. You will know how the hand of the Lord just take you from a simple brother. To the place where you become one of the power brokers in the, in the medical device industry. In the pharmaceutical industry, you won't know how it happened. Even the people there will not know how it happened. Just like they didn't know how Joseph 
Do you think the, do you think the Egyptians were not talking about it? They have gone into it about one year. This guy has been before they now say, wait. One person called another. He said, What do you think is happening here? He said, This foreigner is a ah, prime minister. He's the one ruling us. Ah, the other one has it. But what can you do? Do you have the kind of wisdom he has to rule us? And also, Pharaoh is behind him to kill him. If he hears God's first he would will be dead. <laughs> they didn't know when when when, when Joseph has been imposed on them, they won't know when you have climbed to the top by the hand of God, by the favor of God. They didn't know that Esther was a Jew. To them, it was an Iranian. And the uncle said, Don't talk anything. She has become the head of all the wives, she has become the queen before anybody could ever know anything. And the king promised him everything up to the half of his kingdom found favor by the hand of God by means of fasting and prayer by means of listening to the teaching of the uncle just like the one we read on Sunday Uzziah who started reigning from 16 listening to the teaching of Zechariah the priest and prophet and prospered as he sought the law because there was a man who had understanding in visions and revelation. And I'm telling you now, with the understanding in visions and revelation, I was telling Denise during, during the course of the day, I said, look at Mirella. That's a fine product. See, just listens to me. Even this research conference he went to, it's me. The courses he chose, it's me. I just said, I've been praying. She was in the third year when I was praying. Lord, what will you have Mirella do? And the issue of PhD was just strong on my heart. And I said, Mirella, you will do PhD. He will have to do something with blood. He will have to do with something with blood. As a matter of fact, I was already applying. They already took her for master before you finish level seven. They took her for masters in regulatory affairs in the pharmaceutical industry in Carlos University. And I was not thinking, you see, go to Carlos. I just said, let her finish. Level eight, yeah. She finished level eight, and I said, Okay, let's go to NUIG. You are going to do masters. I'm not looking for money now. I said, Number one, we are starting a fellowship there. Number two, I want you to progress to doing a PhD because I see you somehow in academia. Let go. And she keeps listening to a teaching priest and she's prospering simply. One of the greatest blessings God can give to your life is to give you a teaching priest. I was discharging with, uh, with uh, God yesterday. He just, he just came to my house, giving me something. And in a few minutes, we were discharging. I see that the atmosphere was charged. This guy was already electrified. I didn't plan it. He just came in with rice to come and give me rice. And I, we just said, just sit down, we drink something. And we got to discharge. As he was going, God told me, okay, yes, that is the way people prosper. Under a teaching press, and they are receiving the teaching. They prosper. They prosper. Now I'm bringing the burdens of the Lord to you. That I, and please let us not be under any illusion. There are some of you that are already prospering very well. Can I hear an amen? In reality, there are a number of you that are already a good fashion of who you are, who God wants to make you without making noise. And it's just an example of where God can take you to. Because you keep listening. Because you keep listening. Because you keep listening. And then you pick the words and you pray. Do you get angry? There is nobody that is seated there, maybe apart from Boa, that has never been hungered. Is this one that I picked on recently. But she did not do anything if she's very good. But I just picked on little and I was asked, are you angry? Are you, are you okay? You kiddo, you are a very new, you are very good. Don't worry. <laughs> I used to have time that doctors would be replying me from here when I when I when I when I pray on their head. From here. Who said it's true? You <laughs> are you listening to what I'm saying? But do you see how reply me now? No. You just swallow your anger after some time. <laughs> Even this little one has quickly learned. This young lady. When she came, she was really, after some time, she just calmed down. <laughs> She's supposed to go home this weekend. 
for the birthday of the little sister and she told me pastor will you allow me i said no the mother called me i said there is no chance the mother said i beg i said no i said there is no chance i told the wife she was coming this year that she's not coming home until we finish the whole session that i'm in, in a boot camp <laughs> she now comes to me now not telling me she wants to do things she tells me i am suggesting pastor <laughs> i said no i said very good girl i said now you are a very good person see say i'm just suggesting in case i may be allowed i said thank you for your suggestion i'm thinking about it the other day she told me i'm suggesting if you can allow me to meet with Nathaniel. i said i'll be thinking about it <laughs> i said it's not a bad person but allow me to think no 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 don't put anything on my head like, because i'm dealing with something about you just don't, don't, uh, you know there's none of you that has not been angered are you listening to that because even myself i'm angered <laughs> some spirit just wake me up in the morning sometime in the middle of the night in the morning i am in pain for no reason and i'm on my knees i'm saying lord sorry sorry for the past sorry for the present sorry for the future I don't even know i'm just so sorry i'm just so sorry you know it's because somebody i learned from somebody this week from the son of one of the preachers i said hell is when the person of who you are right now meet with the person of who you could have been you didn't hear me do you know the meaning of hell for a child of god it's when the person of who you are right now now just comes to a place and meet the person of who you could have been is nothing is hotter except after death when they take him to hell. That, that, that i told mirella i told mirella because she says she doesn't want to do uh, masters i want to bond with ebenezer she just gave back to ebenezer two weeks i said the people you started the same course together in italy which was uh, chemical technology and pharmaceutical that's what they call it in the university of Siena. it's a five-year round course you are not permitted to go out until you finish the five years and it's a masters i said by the time they are doing graduation next year which was supposed to be in 2018 and you still have a degree Anna, I said you'll be hungry at yourself. I said I will never allow that. As they were before they graduated, he's already graduated here with masters. So he rhymes. I won't allow somebody to come and be crying to me now. I see from far, and I see far. Are you listening to what I'm saying? I see from far, and I see far. And you should put your spirit under this kind of prayer. You need this prayer to produce. You need this prayer to, you need it to produce. And it's your season. There is something God wants to do with you. Did you hear what I said? It is your season. Don't just be laughing around the street like laughing cow. It's not time to laugh around because you start laughing at 19. In no time, at 22, you just discover that some of your mates are now homemakers and also they have they have they they have career and then you're still talking about uh, my boyfriend is not dealing with me when at age 27 i know some people don't have shame especially in south africa they say a 50 year 55 year old woman say my boyfriend is coming home today <laughs> if they hear it in nigeria if they <laughs> they, will, they will come and almost burn your house <laughs> Your mates have grandchildren. <laughs> you say, but, but who? That's a time and season for everything. This season, I want you to take up on God and say, God, if I've missed it, I am sorry. But right now, what is your plan for my life? I am ready. When the man is ready, God is ready.